this video, I demonstrate how I do blind injections at the superior pole of the sacroiliac joint. I've been doing this for several years. It seems that every few months I have a patient who presents with localized pain who benefits from this procedure. For clarification, the only patients on whom I perform these injections are those patients who localize their pain to the back dimples, also known as the dimples of venous or fossae lumbales lateralis. Anatomically, it is known that beneath these dimples or back divots, as I sometimes call them for the patient, are the superior aspects of the sacroiliac joints. These sacral sulci are anatomically just above the posterior superior iliac spine and also the junction of the base of the sacrum and the posterior iliac crest on either side. The patient must have their low back pain exactly localized to this area. These indentions are actually created by a short ligament stretching between the skin and the posterior superior iliac spine. The only patients who I inject and inject with consistent successful pain relief are, are these patients. The procedure is done using sterile technique. Whether or not these injections are periarticular or intraarticular is not clear. Nevertheless, pain relief seems to consistently occur. It may not matter because there are a number of reports that describe excellent results with steroid and anesthetic injection periarticular. So in summary, I inject these painful areas with a uh, 1.5 inch needle buried deep into the tissues and the syringe is a 3 ml syringe containing 2.5 ml bupivacaine and 0.6 ml or 40 milligrams of salumedrol. The, the needle typically goes through a deep fascia or ligament layer of tissue. Relief is almost immediate for the patient. The patient in this video had ongoing pain relief several days later when I had a chance to speak with her daughter. You've been having this pain going on how long? Well, I've been, it started coming on me for a week. For and a week? Yesterday it got real bad. Okay. And what makes pain worse? Bending over or getting up from a chair? Getting up. Okay. Getting up, I, I just you want to, you want to sit right in the chair side. and just demonstrate for us? I mean, I hate to put you okay. through, right. put through pain. You're walking very gingerly. Okay, that hurts. Mm -hmm. so, all, right, all right. Okay, then go ahead and get up. And that's causing you a heck of a lot of pain. Okay, good enough. And then let's have you come over here and we'll have you sit down on the bed. Do, do you hurt here? Yeah. Huh? Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Hurt there, hurt there, hurt there? No. And, but it gets really bad down in here, huh? We'll help you out here. As she, okay. Perfect. Okay. Right there. Some pain up here, some pain up there, some pain up there. Mm -hmm. But like right around this where you're having pain, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So what I'm doing is I'm just, I found this place and I just went down with my pen um, just to make an indent in the skin so I know where my target is, okay? What we're going to do here is some bupivacaine and salumedrol. I'm going to do about 40 milligrams of salumedrol and uh, 2.5 cc's of bupivacaine. It's going to burn a little. Should do it. Aspirate a little bit. They're gonna feel like you go through a little capsule there. You don't feel any tingling down your legs or anything like that, all right? No. no. Okay, so I put in 0.6 cc's of um, salumedrol, which is 40 milligrams, and 2.5 of bupivacaine. And um, I'm going right into the area where she has the pain. I'm gonna fan this a little bit in a minute. I'm just gonna do an initial injection here. Okay.
Okay. And that's it. And so we're going to let her lay there for just a minute. Then we're going to um, have her get up and move. And let's just see if uh, she's made any progress. Let's put a let's go ahead and put a bandaid over that. All right. It's just been two minutes. Let's see if we've gotten any of your pain relieved, okay? Gotcha. Just, yeah. yeah, start, go ahead and start turn over. Feeling a little bit better? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Feeling, Feeling a little bit better? Mm -hmm. Okay. Then swing your legs over the side of the bed there. <laughs> now you're, you're smiling. It's better. Is it better? Yes, sir. Okay. I ain't been able to do that since yesterday morning. Yeah. All right, let's, let's have you stand up. Mm. Is it... A, look, she's got... I'm not going to show her face, but she's got a look of smiling yes. gratitude. Oh, I let's, let's have you walk a little bit. Mm. Let's have you go over here and sit in this chair then. Sit in this chair? Yeah, yeah. Mm. <laughs> Is that it? Okay. okay. Cool. All right. Hey, so this this steroid um, is going to um, start to do its job. Oh, look at you. So the steroid is going to do its job, and the uh, numbing medicine is going to wear off in five or six hours. Okay. But we're going to still give you some pain meds to go home. Okay. okay. But the steroid is going to be doing its thing.